Hello and welcome to this how tech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to show you how to use the sum product formula in Excel 2016. So we have our columns here of units and unit cost. And say we wanted to multiply each one of these with a unit cost. That would grant us a total. However, say we wanted to go ahead with this without the total column, we would need to use either a separate sum and product formula or simply use the sum product formula, which using that way, we'll clean up some larger formulas and we'll also cut down on this total thing instead of putting it off the side or in a different sheet. So if we wanted to get started here, multiplying the units by unit cost, click down here, and we'll just go ahead and put down our formula. Start with equals some product, of course. And then an open parentheses tells us it wants the first array. So we'll go ahead and get that first array, comma, for the second array. We can also put more arrays in here, but right now we just want units and unit cost. Close that, and we can go ahead and hit enter when all that's done and it will give us the correct value. The sum of the products of each of those rows. Now if we wanted to, just to make sure, we're going to go ahead and take all of these rows from the total column and we're going to sum them up just to make sure our answer is correct and that the sum product is working all right just to show you. And as you can see, we get the correct answer. This has been a How Tech Video Tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.